Well, here I am in Iceland, hitting the road now for the big trip around the country. And I plan to stop and hike and see the sights and just enjoy. And I also plan on doing all of this with no food. So I am going to be going for the whole week hiking and trekking and being with uh, being with the natural formations in the, in the open air with zero calories. Zero! Uh, let's hope I can do it. Driving through a cloud right now. Perfect whiteout. Cannot see several feet in front of you. You know, the best part about not having to eat is that it makes me so efficient on this trip. I can bounce from place to place after place after place after place without any breaks. And it makes me so productive during the day. Oh, it's amazing. My travel efficiency is just unstoppable. Nine o'clock at night. Look at it. It's the brightest day. It is day. But I am going to force myself to sleep. I'm staying in a beautiful hotel. It's a small one. It's about the size of a uh, Suzuki Swift. Yep, that's bed. Whoa, 3 30 a.m. Sun's up. <laughs> I guess it's time to get going. Look at this place. This is pure fantasy land. Check this out. Easily, easily one of the most gorgeous landscapes I've had the pleasure of navigating through on this trip. Like this is just so real. Oh, there are roaming sheep everywhere. Beautiful, beautiful landscape here in Iceland. Just, just chilling. Definitely one trip that I, I can't imagine doing with someone else. You need to do this one alone. I mean, unless you have a plan booked with the family or you have particular excursions um, detailed ahead of time. If you're just going for a trip around the island and you want to see the sights as they come, you, you got to do this on your own. Like, I, it, there's just, I, I don't know how, <laughs> I don't know how I would do this with someone else. Well, it was a great trip, you know, I had an awesome time, I had a fantastic journey and um, doing it all while fasting, uh, I learned a lot. I learned so much on this trip, um, life-changing experience. And anyway, it's going to be great to get home back to, back to Canada, back to Toronto and of course when we see mom it's going to be great because 
Uh, Mama always likes to have me come home from these solo adventures and I love coming home to her too. So uh, yeah, it'll be nice.